Shalom. Welcome back to another episode of Bible Secrets Reveal. First and foremost, I'm going to give all praises, glory, and honor to Yahweh, Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone. And salutations to your brothers uh, pushing this word sincerely. Uh, <clears throat> this is going to be also a GMS scripture of the day. And I'm going to hop right into it because this whole... Uh, Thing about this transgendered bathroom debate bullshit. All all this discussion is nothing but a straight abomination. It's totally wicked, and it's totally against the scriptures. This is just uh, one of many reasons why the society must and will be destroyed, according to the Holy Bible. And when I say society, I mean this so-called uh, white man's world, man. You so-called Western. Uh, European <clears throat> nations and all you other nations that follow the so-called white man. You got a temporary expiration date. And then the nation of Israel, the true nation of Israel, you so-called uh, blacks, Latinos, and Native Americans scattered to the four corners of the earth, waking up that you're a part of the 12 tribes, are going to be the future uh, leaders of the world, man, the everlasting kingdom, which will be here on earth, according to the Bible. But uh, back to the topic, you know, right back into the scripture. This is Deuteronomy 22 and 5. The woman shall not wear that which pertaineth unto a man. Neither shall a man put on a woman's garment. For all that do so, for all that do so are abomination unto the Lord thy power. Right. So all you so-called uh, he, she's, transgendered, LGBT, whatever, you're a straight abomination, man. And you will be destroyed, okay? And any society that embraces this is going to be destroyed too. Thus save the Holy Scriptures, okay? <clears throat> and this is just straight to the point, man. Because the society is coming more and more wickeder by the day. And this is just, like I said, one of many reasons... Why this place has to go. Damn transgendered bathroom. There ain't no transgender. You're either male or female. Period, man. And you dress accordingly. Okay? And this is just going to be it for the uh, <coughs> GMS scripture of the day. Shalom.